In this video I'm reviewing the Shark Trupet vacuum cleaner with the help of my Springer Spaniel Storm. I've had the vacuum just over a year and wanted to let you guys know how it's performed. I'll cover the parts of the vacuum, how it performs on carpet, floor mats, stairs and hard floors, then finish off with how to maintain it properly so it's ready to go again. Links to the vacuum are in the description below. Storm's job was simple, over the next two weeks put as much hair and dirt as you can on the carpet and the kitchen floor. She totally nailed her job. The Shark Trupet is a very user friendly and has anti hair app technology which works surprisingly well. It's very well laid out, all the hoses and connectors connect and disconnect easily, making it really fast to swap between the nozzles, whether you're cleaning the carpet, stairs or hard floors. The carpet, fireplace and TV were covered in dog hairs. The Shark Trupet made short work of removing all the hairs. This is what two weeks of Springer hair looks like. To empty the container it's one click to release, take it to the bin, release the bottom switch and it all falls out into the bin. Once the carpet had been vacuumed I swapped in the nozzle, attacked the fireplace and TV. For the sofas I used the upholstery cleaner which is very effective at removing the hairs. Moving on to the hallway, the dirty spot in the whole house, Trupet did an amazing job and removed all the hairs and the dirt. It also works really great on floor mats too. On the handle there's a hard floor selector switch which stops the brushes from spinning, this works great on my kitchen floor. For the stairs there's a dedicated stair cleaner which attaches to the hand nozzle. To make the vacuum lighter it's a good idea to use the release button, this makes the vacuum considerably lighter for carrying up the stairs. To reconnect it when you're done, there are guides so it quickly slots back in. Moving on to maintenance, remove the container, remove the sponge filter, rinse the sponge filter with fresh water, let it absorb as much water as possible, then give it a squeeze. Repeat this until you get clean water coming out of the sponge. Once no more dirt comes out, leave it in the sunlight to dry off. Then rinse off the dust cover. I'd also recommend rinsing the container, open it at both ends, once the dust has been removed leave it in the sun to dry out. Tilt the vacuum cleaner on its side to access the anti-hair roller, rotate the roller and remove the hairs. Doing this regularly ensures the vacuum cleaner keeps working efficiently. Overall I'm super happy with this vacuum cleaner and so is Storm. It does a fantastic job of cleaning the house, hard surfaces and stairs and you can also use it to clean your car. If you found this useful hit that like button and smash that subscribe and thanks for watching.